Hey everyone, I'm going to show you the things I got for my birthday and for Christmas in December 2019. There's three birthday things, which is early December, so I'm going to do, the, do those first. Here we have PlayStation 4 Monster Hunter World. It has really good ratings right here, and the pictures on the back look really cool, especially this one right here. That looks almost like a T-Rex, but it's probably classified as a monster, and that, that one's cool right there too. I played it earlier, one of this, and it was good, so this is probably even better, maybe? I don't know. Okay, so that was my first of three birthday things. Here's the second. It is a poetic phone case. This is just a box. I will show you the phone case in a minute. So, poetic phone case. And the third thing I got for my birthday out of three things is a Samsung Galaxy Note 10. This is a phone box, and I will show you the phone in a second. Uh, this blue thing is a picture of the stylus that it comes with. So, let's see, here is the phone, um, I have the stylus out already because when you take it out it knows that you took it out and it starts doing weird stuff that I don't want it to do. So um, it does regular phone stuff and this is going to be super hard for, to show on the uh, camera because it's like all reflective like a mirror kind of. It's like a blue rainbowy color, you should probably google it if you want to see what it actually looks like um, without all the reflections. Um, so it does all the regular stuff, and then the stylus, um, it draws really good, like, let's see, um, see, like, you could draw, if you press lightly, it, it draws thin, and then you can, uh, draw thicker, so, and, you know, all, all the things you expect from a stylus, and what's cool about this kind of is, um, it doesn't react, I can't draw with my finger, so you can actually, like, rest your hand on it, and your hand won't mess up the drawing. You can it'll only respond to this thing right here. And that goes in like that. And like that. And in this case is oh here's the case too. Um it sticks out so it protects the screen. And it goes around the camera like that. So okay, that was the birthday stuff. Now here comes the Christmas stuff. The first thing I had for Christmas was this candy, which I already ate. But here's the box. I put it back so it looks good. There's nine of these in there. They're um, really good. And I also got these. These are like Christmas Eve kind of open early presents. Um, it is a little Oregon Trail, com um, not a computer game, but like a, a handheld, uh, I don't know what you call it, but it's really neat. I guess a handheld. Um, it comes on. Uh, it, yeah. Look at that. I haven't played it yet because I haven't, I haven't opened it. But it looks just like the old uh, computer game. And it came with batteries. I, I don't know how many batteries it takes, but um, I got these. So that looks awesome. I used to play this uh, a little bit when it came out and I never won it. So maybe I can now beat it on this handheld. Okay, so that is all that stuff. Now we're going to start opening this box here. Um, they're all in here. Okay, so here... And all this stuff's random, randomly organized. There's no, like... Uh, order to it. I'm just picking out what's on the top of the box. This is a Transformer Inferno. He turns into a fire truck. He's pretty big. This is a pretty big box. Uh, this is Power of the Primes series. And it looks like that when it's transformed, which is very cool. It's like a um, ladder truck. Not a ladder, but a... What do you call it? I don't, I don't know what you call it. And that looks awesome. I'll add that to my Transformers collection. Okay, next is another game. This is a PlayStation 4 Medieval. Um, I don't know if this is a remake of the PlayStation 1 game, but uh, I will find out later when I open it. It looks cool. I remember the first one seemed like super awesome, and I always wanted to play the first one. So if this is the first, if this is a remake, that would be great. And all right, that is another gift. Okay, so here, let's see, this is, uh, this is just an empty bag. Here we have some candy. I pretty much get one of these every year. I've, I've gotten this, something like this every year since I was a kid. Uh, Whitman's Sampler candy. It's, this one's like double layer. So there's like two layers of chocolates. And they are super good. One of my favorite candies or chocolates or whatever. Okay, here we have a Nintendo Switch case. 
Um, there's no like name or anything. Starter kit. Okay, so this is a. It feels like really nice cloth, and it's got controller covers and a cable and a cleaning cloth. And that looks very cool. It's got this kind of like a fake leather embossed stripe. And it looks really nice quality. Okay, next we have... Um, this is a RCA brand tablet type of thing. I'm not exactly sure what you call it, but... Voyager Pro, it, uh, it's in Spanish, maybe the other side is in English, I don't know. Key tablet with keyboard case. So I guess you could use it like this, or like this. And uh, so I haven't opened that yet, but it looks really cool. I wonder if it plays Pokemon Go. Okay, next we have a Street Fighter. Okay. Um, I already, I got this last year, I think, and I told the person I already have this, and they said I could get something different, so instead of this, I'm getting, um, Wario, some Wario wear, Wario wear game for the 3DS, I think. Uh, it looked really fun, so, uh, I guess I'm maybe return this or something. And next we have a, uh-oh. Okay, we have a CD, which is, I don't know if it's single or album or like a half album. This is a Nine Inch Nails CD with like six songs or five or something, I don't know. Uh, looks pretty cool, that's one of my favorite bands. It looks like a computer chip right there. And here we have a book uh, about one of my other favorite bands, The True Story of Faith No More. So it's like full of uh, stuff to read and some nice color photos, some that I've never seen before. A bunch of pretty uh, unique photos if you're, if you like follow this band. Okay, next we have uh, some cables, <laughs> USB cables, type C. Those are always useful. I use a lot of, a lot of the stuff I have uses these cables, so they're good for charging and stuff. And, um, they're only, most cables seem to only be good for a few months, and then they don't work anymore. They don't charge that good. So, that, more cables is good. Here's PlayStation 4 Borderlands 3. I played the first one, and it was really fun and cool. The second one, I don't think I ever played. I might have. But I definitely played the first one, and, I, and it was, it was fun. And this is the third one. I like how the cover is, like, a kind of rainbowy. And... Looks like it's got some cool stuff going on over here. So that should be really fun. Okay, I think I'm over starting to run out of things. This is like a uh, not not a lot of stuff this year, but uh, really good stuff. So this is um like I haven't I'm not gonna I might open this for video, so I don't really know what's inside, but it's a matchbox box of fifty. 50 cars, and uh, yeah, that's that's pretty much all I know about it. It's got it's got different logos on the box, so I'm not sure if this is like something that is for retailers. Like, this is the store supposed to get this and open it up and put it on the shelf, or is this just for like regular people? I don't know, but it looks cool. And 50 cars is always good. Okay, I think there's only three things left. We go over here. Okay, here is one of the things, one of the three things. Star Wars Smuggler's Bounty. Uh, this is like a, I don't know if it's a blind box or not, but it's a box of Funko stuff. I think it's, uh, it's the Funko brand, you know, like Funko Pops, and uh, they make action figures and shirts and all kinds of making all kinds of stuff now. But anyways, it's a box of Star Wars stuff. So that is one of the things, and I, I'm not going to open it right now. And the other, another thing I got is another one, but it's different. See, this one has orange stuff on it, and this one has, like, green stuff on it. 
So I guess there's different stuff inside the box. And this one has plastic, so I can't even like look inside if I wanted to. Um, so that should be fine. I'll probably do both of these in one video. Uh, I'm not gonna like Google it to see what's inside or anything. I'm just gonna let it be a surprise for now. And I got one more thing, which is kind of big. Uh oh. So the last Christmas thing I got was this uh, World of Warcraft box set collector's edition. It's got um, it's got a statue, and it's it's like huge. The box is huge and it's heavy. It's got ah. It comes with mounts for the game, and uh, I don't know what that is, and a pin, and uh, a mouse pad, and uh, oh, it comes with a, this is like the regular size collector's edition, so you can, once you open this big huge box, you can take out this smaller box and put it with your other collector's editions, which are that size, which are like a book size, a thick book. So they all go together, and then you can keep the statue out. So this is this is really really big, and it's really rare, I guess. I don't know. It's the type of thing where they put it out in the store, and then it sells out really fast, so it's hard to get. And um, this is to celebrate the 15th anniversary of WoW or World of Warcraft. So that is cool. I'm glad I got this because uh, I kind of collect these things, so this will go good with my other ones. Mm. Oh, so, oh, this thing is a Prince. Fine art Prince. Alright, so that's, I think, oh, and I got a shirt. Uh, I'll put it right here. Uh, a picture of a shirt that I got, uh, but they said it, it hasn't come yet. So this is a shirt for um, a band that I like. And it's coming in the mail in a couple days, because it was late in the mail for Christmas. Alright, thanks for, uh, oh, and I got this, um, Death Stranding. This is a, a game I've been wanting to play since it came out. And uh, this is probably the first game I'm going to play right after I do this video. This is a game where you are this guy, and you have, you are like, kind of like a mailman, but like, the world is all messed up, so you have to like, go across empty lands and monsters and you have like these boxes and you have to deliver the boxes and I guess stuff's trying to kill you or something so it, it looks really fun uh, and unique and you have a a, a baby <laughs> a baby and a an, and a thing on your stomach or something so anyways all right so thanks for watching and uh, tell me what you got in the for Christmas in the comments and thanks for watching see you later Okay, I'm super disorganized, and I forgot about this, and I haven't even actually looked in here, except for I grabbed one of these out the top. Um, one of these I ate, this one, and this one I, I still have. It's it's peppermint bark. It's white chocolate with uh, um, uh, candy cane pieces, and I think it's dark chocolate on the back, or regular chocolate, I don't know. It tasted really good, so maybe dark chocolate. And let's see. Um... Toothpick things for after you eat all the candy that's probably in here. Let's see. Oh, these are good. Hershey nuggets. Whole big bag of these. Almonds. Ah, those are really, really good. Okay. Uh, oh, a little peppermint bark thing. Russell Stover. In case you don't know what peppermint bark is, um... It's, it's like a white, white chocolate with little candy pieces in it. Peppermint candy. And usually dark chocolate or milk chocolate on the back. Uh, it doesn't have to have this, but it's usually at least white chocolate with peppermint things in it. Okay, what is this? This is like a mix. Um, Milky Way Midnight? I don't know what that is. Twix. Milky Way... Three Musketeers, Snickers, um, a bunch of really good stuff. I love chocolate. Let's see. I think this is the last thing in here. Oh, uh, more Snickers. Snickers are great. Um, 
Snickers minis. So bite-sized things. Okay, I think that's it. All right. Thank you. Bye.